Jiminy Christmas. That thing is a rock. Oh. All right, welcome to Florida Keys Life. I'm Jason. I'm Reagan. And this is Reagan, and I'm it's Haley. Haley. We're going out bow fishing tonight. Nighttime bow fishing. Not Florida Keys, we're obviously not in the Keys. We're still up in Central Florida here near Orlando, and we've got a charter that we're gonna head out on. Never done them before. Let's see how it goes. I guess it is Keys related because we're close by, well, not far away. About six hours drive anyway. So when you live in the Keys, you can do cool stuff like this. So. Wish us luck. Yeah, I have no idea how this is gonna go. Nighttime, <laughs> what do you think, buggers? Um, I'm excited. Uh, it's fun to try stuff that you can do that's new. Usually you don't get to do this kind of stuff. But, um, yeah. On an airboat, too. We are, uh, did have to buy pants. I mean, we live in the Keys, we don't have pants, so we had to go buy pants. That's what our skipper says he wanted for bow fishing is pants. Lots of Buggers with the pants. Lots of super poor cool birds. Where'd they go? Yeah, there are all these crazy red-necked crane things that wanted to eat your eyes. Welcome to Florida Keys Life. Okay. How are you all doing? Good, how are you? I'm Bobby. Bobby, nice to meet you. I'm Haley. Haley? Yes. And I'm Reagan. And Reagan? Yeah. Yep. Oh, like the president. Yes. Like yep. the president. Except E-N on the end instead of A-N. Yeah. <laughs> Reagan and Haley. Yeah. And Jason. I'm old, so I might forget. So. That's all right. Okay. No worries. Who's going to not shoot? You? Me. Yes. I'm up there. All righty. Now, this is a whole new experience for us. All kinds of beautiful scenery and such here. These are the Kissimmee Lakes. I guess there's a bunch of them that are connected in this area. Now, it's, you think about where we're normally out doing videos, it's in beautiful, crystal clear, almost Bahamas-like water of the Florida Keys. And this is definitely not that, but it is definitely beautiful in its own way. We head out in an airboat. We've been out in an airboat before, but obviously never in this area. And this airboat was really nice, nice, comfy seats and such. And so we're heading out to a spot to get a little orientation and learn how to shoot these bows and uh, get this figured out. So enjoy the scenery and we'll get to the orientation here. So we're here with Co Captain Bobby Hansel, is that right? Hansel, yes sir. And he's lived here a couple years. I've lived here a long time. Long time. <laughs> and it's Kissimmee, not Kissimmee. Kissimmee. <laughs> which, Kissimmee is, which is just over there. We're, uh, on, we're on West Lake Tohopetalaga. Everybody calls it West Lake Toho or Big Lake Toho. 23,000 acres. And we're here to bow fish um, with uh, Orlando bow fishing and gator hunts. Orlando bow fishing gator hunt. So we got Reagan here has been practicing with her bow. I've taken a few shots. I have no idea if we're going to hit anything. What do you think, Haley? Do you think we're going to hit anything? And we certainly wouldn't if I was doing it, but maybe. Uh, maybe. Definitely. We got light Reagan, sockets here. Are. Definitely. Yeah. There's fish all over the place here. I mean, this place is definitely loaded with fish. If we had any place where we could possibly hit something, I would think this has got to be a place. <laughs> I think you're going to get some shots, so yeah. leave, leave the hitting. It's like I tell everybody, it's fun. It's not easy. It's fun. It's not easy. Enjoy yeah. the experience. I, it was, I mean, just the little ride that we had from the launch out to here was great. I mean, that was yeah, perfect temperature tonight. 
It's not windy. It's nice. We're not getting. I'm getting murdered by bugs. Is that not a bugs not a problem here? The the bugs are our key to start bow fishing. When uh, the bugs start, it's time to go. Okay. Yeah. So we're good. We still got another half hour, 45 minutes or so, and and the bugs will come out. The bugs will come out, and we'll go bow fishing. Okay. No deal. And I can we, hear them. I'm starting to hear them. We haven't done this before, but apparently we're going to be idling along here, and Reagan and I are going to be picking them off the boat. So we've got to be functional enough that Captain Bobby can keep moving, <laughs> and we can cover some ground while we shoot and retrieve, shoot and retrieve. So we got to get to that point. You think you're going to be up to it, Regs? Yeah, right. I got it. What are we gonna do with these fish? Are they, have you, what are you, have you eaten them? The tilapia take on the flavor of what you would think the grass tastes like. Mm. Gonna hear it click, if it doesn't, hand it to me. There you go. Should be fine there. There you go. You're good to go. Good form. best thing to do is just pick out a little piece of grass somewhere and see how close you can come to it. And what I would do, y'all, is adjust the hats to where no matter what, they won't come off of your head. You don't want to have a headache. Don't make it so tight that you got a headache. But if it falls, if you're looking down and it falls off of your head and hits the water, it's done. You just fry it. They're, they're, they are hot, by the way, also. Getting geared up. Let me see, Regs. Nice. You just throw that cord right over your shoulder, Regs. Yeah. Perfect. There you go, all the way to the front, stand in the corner. So, here we go. I'm going to start moving. If y'all see a fish, you can go ahead and shoot at it. My first shot was a miss. So part of the tricky part here is learning how to work the crossbow in the reel assembly. So you've got a little lever on the front of the crossbow that you have to pull back to reel. Otherwise it's just well, the reels of free school and you're sitting there spinning it and you don't retrieve anything. So it's kind of tricky to learn how to do it. Right? The long way hand, break it loose. Just remember the boat, you can you can actually stop the boat with your hand. There's nothing, there's no propeller down there or anything else like that. Not. Okay, just remember if you got the the the, the, the brake too tight, you're gonna have a hard time reeling. Too loose, it won't reel at all. You gotta have it just right, remember? Pull it with your hand if you need it. It's not the it's problem. loose. It's thing. It won't reel. Well, it's like jam. Oh, there you go. Uh, with a little slow start for us, I'm not going to bore you with all the boring stuff. We'll get to some fish here when we get this all figured out. But we were seeing lots of fish, still trying to figure out how to work the bows, how to retrieve everything. Just getting dark here. These headlamps, by the way, were pretty cool. It's a halogen bulb attached to your your forehead that you can look and see exactly where you're shooting. Seems like a pretty good idea. There's other ways you could do it, but that seemed to work out pretty good. So we'll get on to some some uh, fish shooting here coming up. So just stand by. There you go. Good try. Got him, got him. Got him. That's a two for three. There you go. Nice. So far. 
good shooting for somebody who hadn't done it before. What is it? Is that one of those guys? Like under the boat. It's okay. Just keep pulling. Reach up with your hand, pull the line. I might have gone. There you go. The best way to do him is try to rip it right out of there, grab both sides of the line, see if it'll come off. I'm assuming he's got some teeth, huh? There you go. There you go. Alligator food. Alligator guard. Alligator food. Missing half the face. <laughs> Feed them gators. Where should I toss this thing? Anywhere. Just chunk him in there. Alligator will get him. All right, gator. Go for it. Yeah, you may have to get that jawbone off. That is a Florida spotted gar. There you go. Florida spotted gar. Okay, so just set this down on the seat, out of the way. Yep. Okay. And then unscrew your tip undo, a little bit. You can pull undo, it off. Undo the tip. Unscrew it. Three turns to the left. There yep. you go. One. Two, now we want to kill. We want to dispatch this thing, right? Because it wants to be eaten. Yeah, we or want to throw it back in. Back in throw just... it back in the water. Throw it back in. Oh. You don't have to grab the fish. You can actually just jump, dump him right off of the yeah. off of the arrow. Just tip it. Okay. Yep. There yep. you go. Hard. Shake him. There you go. Nice. And he's off. Good job, buddy. Look at that. They're both bow fishers. <laughs> Good job, buddy. You got it. Woo! Got it. Oh! That's that a big tilapia. Wow! Look at about that. what did I shoot at? That. What is that? That big tilapia. What are you talking about? What did I shoot at? Gee, mini Christmas kid. That's a tilapia there. Bam. Okay. Christmas kid. Good job. That's a tilapia there. Wow. Watch your top fins. He's huge. You're good right now. Looks like you nailed him pretty good. I bet he goes in the cooler. The next okay. time, I would oh. put the bow on the ground, open the cooler lid, and drop him right in the cooler. Okay. And they'll flap off really, really quick off the boat. He's but like, they ain't got any teeth, right? I can, I can lip them? They don't have any teeth. This wind is... That's probably our average size tilapia. Wind is... That's probably Dang. our average size tilapia right there. Dang. That's pretty right there. Dang. That's pretty good. Look at that thing. Is yeah. that thing working? Yeah, but your light's kind of yeah. cast in a... Sometimes you got to shut your light off. Yeah. Nice. I want to Bam. Ah, oh, Regs, I should have let you shoot that one. Sorry, buddy. What? Ah, oh, Regs, I should have let you shoot that one. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. That's a good-sized one, too. Oh, those are kind of sharp. Oh, bang. Look at that. Yeah, big one. They look so small. Come take a look at him if you want to. Look at him. He's got kind of a blue green face. I got red tips on the tail. Look at him. You should probably hold it up so you can make him. Okay. He's got kind of a blue. Yeah, they're Green. kind of a pretty fish yeah. when you look at them. They got red tips on the tail. Look at them. You should probably hold up so you can make a thumbnail. Yeah, here's our thumbnail. <laughs> see, the, see the green in front of his eyes? That's algae. Ah. Ah. Uh. 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 They got frozen. Be... They got frozen tilapia at Costco. That's got to be four or five pounds right there. <laughs> They get up to about eight, but that's a good average tilapia for here. You know me, I like to keep YouTube land real, and it was not all rainbows and unicorns here. We had our fair share of misses here. Oh, oh it no. pulled out. Oh, no. no. I think he's coming at you. Yep. 
I'm not sure it's a tilapia. It's a it, tilapia. It is a nice one too. Looked a little too big for a tilapia <laughs> for a second. Look at that. Holy cow. That's a big fish. That's a good one. That was a little bigger. He wasn't there. all the way through either. Yeah. Damn it in Christmas. Those are huge. Just unscrew the arrow. You got the right kind of head to, to do that. Yeah. Now Megan, if uh, Reagan, if she shoots one, she's got to drive it through because you got to do the tip. The tip. Yeah. Okay. The two different types of heads I've got. Look at that one. That is a horse. That one's bigger than the other. Yeah, that's a good one. That's why I didn't think it was a floppy. It looked too long. <laughs> Look at that thing. What else could it have been? Man. A big bass. Look up, honey. Nice shot. Got it. Good job. Nice. Nailed it. Nice. Nailed it. Good job. Step backwards one step, uh, Reagan. There you go. Put some weight on this side. There you go. Well, nice that's job. Got to get him in. Well, he did not look that big in the water. Another good size. Yeah, these guys look bigger in the water, don't they? Okay. They're kind of pretty with that red tail. Yeah. see a really oh. weird fish if you've never seen one of these before you've got to touch it oh my goodness look at him i think i got one did you he was just sitting at the bottom and i shot right where it is pull up with your hands Are you, i had to, i <laughs> saw it it was right there it oh my gopro died hey Reagan. oh no hey Reagan. Reagan. Let me see. this thing Take is your a finger rock. and touch him touch this thing him. is a rock no. oh, oh man no, no. Hey Reagan. Reagan. this thing Take is a rock and touch him touch this thing him. is a rock no. Oh, that was it. it is each one of those see. plates has got like a little thing on it. Plated catfish, armor plated catfish. Wow. See the blue, hot. see the blue on their fins? They even got blue in between their top dorsal. Yeah. Wow. So That's what it did those we want to put this in the cooler too or what? No? no? no. Go ahead, okay. Here, take a picture. You actually shot at a different one. I was looking at another one. I thought you were gonna shoot at him. You got a little red here too. See the red? Has he got any spines on him or anything that's going to stay? He does, just like a regular catfish. You got these here and the one on the top. Okay. But now those in fish tanks, yeah. one of them is about four or five inches long, will be $60 or $70. Wow. And that's called a pleco. Oh, there's right. another one right there, Reagan. Look at right at the top. Right there. Hit him right there. That's literally what I had. And then it, I hit it and it bounced right off. Well, they are hard. Oh, you missed him too. How? You saw. Yeah, this thing's like a. Thing. This thing's hard as a rock. Oh, and it's like it, they've got little spines on each one of their plates. Yeah, yeah it'll stay going that way. It'll get you. Prehistoric. Oh. Hmm. All right, through the. Yeah, here we go. Back to the water. <laughs> you got him. Reg's got one. What you got, buddy? What kind did you get, Reg? You don't know? Oh, one of those All right. Oh, armored catfish. Pleco. Oh, right. Hey, you got to get a picture of that. Oh. Right well, through the corner. The nice. There you go. Oh, it's easy. I'll tell you Good what. Job, buddy. I, I want to get a picture, too. You guys kind of stand up. Shut your lights off. Okay. Because the reflection is really bad. I'm going to get a... Now this was a real fun night. We were out there till 11 o'clock. They have a no noise ordinance at 11 o'clock on the lake, so you gotta head back. And we hit the dock pretty much at 11. Uh, and we we got as many fish as we wanted to have. It had as much fun as we needed to have. And we headed back, and now you'll see what we had back at the dock. Now I wanna tell a funny story about these tilapia being invasive species. 
the state of Florida actually wants you to shoot them and get rid of these lakes. Uh, however, they were the ones that put them in the lakes, and Captain Bobby, Bobby Hansel was able to explain the story to me. They put them in there years ago that they thought they were supposed to eat some uh, plant that was causing problems in the lake that's still there. It turns out that they only eat the algae off of that particular plant. Uh, and that they mess with bass habitat, so it, it causes harm to the bass and them being able to spawn in the sanded area. So now they want to get rid of them, but they're the ones that put them there. Okay, well there we have it. That was our harvest for tilapia. Pretty good size one. That one there is probably, that's got to be six pounds. Yep. I don't know. What do you think, Bobby? Yep, probably yeah. six. Yeah. yeah. So how did this misfit crew do? Did, had Reagan, she popped some fish. I got a few, I was probably 40 to 50%. Regs, you're probably 20 to 30% on your okay. shots, huh? For but, the first time doing it, you guys did very, very well. <laughs> oh, well, thank you so much. You were too kind. What do you think about the experience as a whole, Regs? Would you want to do it again? Yeah, I would. Yes. Was it, was <laughs> it like... frustrating or was it fun? Uh, it was really frustrating, but I mean, it's fun if like you get really good at it. <laughs> What do you think from the observation perfect. standpoint? I thought it was awesome. I just watched yeah. and shone the flashlight in the water and we saw some alligators and I'd do it again. Absolutely. Do it again. Yeah, we definitely do it again. Saw lots of gators, got, got lots of variety of fish, and we helped get rid of some invasive species. And a local family here in the area likes to eat these fish, so yep. that's, that's who's going to eat them. So we helped feed people and we got rid of some invasive species. And it was a lot of fun. So we appreciate you. Follow along. Please like and subscribe. The lighting's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good day.